absolutely wonderful. So today I'm in the Lake District National Park just outside Patterdale and I'm going to do a little bit of wild camping and some landscape photography. Now my plan is to head up to Angle Tarn which is somewhere just up there and set up camp near the tarn and then gonna find a couple of nice locations for sunrise and sunset to take some nice images. Uh, it's a gorgeous day today. Um, it's planned on being really nice over the next couple of days. So I've got a bit of a long hike ahead of me. So I'm going to crack on with that and I shall see you guys at the top. managed to make it up here after a little bit of a struggle um, that backpack's quite heavy with all its equipment so um, but it was worth it most definitely worth it anyway so I managed to find myself a nice little place to pitch my tent right next to this time uh, which is absolutely glorious um, I'm not the only one with the same idea there's about another five or six tents all pitched up as well so I think everyone's making the most of this uh, glorious weather so hopefully we'll be in for in store for a nice sunset this evening and uh, it looks pretty good for sunrise in the morning too. So I've got a little bit of time to kill before sunset. So I'm gonna head up to these crags just up here just to see if there's a shot to be had. And then also I'm gonna head up to the Angle Tarn Pikes just up there just to see if there's a shot to be had up there as well. So I'm gonna go crack on with that and then I'll catch you guys shortly and we'll go through uh, composition and stuff. Right, so I've just come over to the other side of the tarn. And earlier on we had a nice little bit of light just catching on those crags just over there. We also had some really nice light just streaming through the valley in the background. Now we've got some composition on this. So we've got this really nice island and we've got this really nice outcrop bit as well. That's providing us with a little bit of foreground interest. And then we've got the Angle Tarn Pike just over there, which is providing us a little bit of middle ground interest. And then we've got these really nice fells in the background, which will be silhouetted. And that's uh, giving us some really nice background. So regards to filters on the camera, I'm using a polarizer just to cut out any reflections. We're also using two ND grads, one a 0.9, one a 0.6, both soft edge graduated filters. And that sounds quite like quite a lot, but um, earlier on there was a big contrast difference between the sky and the foreground. So um, really wanted to use two filters just to kind of hold that detail back. And also we're using a 10 stop ND filter as well. And that's just giving us a long exposure just so we can smooth out that water. So with regards to settings on this, um, 
we were shooting at three minutes and 20 seconds and F9 and ISO 100. So that's me pretty much done here for this evening. So I'm gonna head back over to my tent, go and cook some dinner, and then I shall see you guys in the morning for sunrise. Morning guys, so it's around about four o'clock in the morning and I've just come up onto Angle Tarn Pikes. And I've got this really lovely view of Place Fell and then we're looking up over towards the north end of the Lake District. And as you can see, we've got to some really nice pre-dawn light coming through over the horizon there. So my plan is to take a panoramic picture starting from Placeville just over there, panning round to the right and finishing around about just over here. So with regards to filters, we've got a 0.9 soft edge graduated filter on the front there and settings we're using F9, ISO 100 and about six second shirt speed. Right, so just over here to my left, I'm hoping when that sun comes up over the horizon, we're gonna get some really nice light hitting those fells. So we've got the Helvellum range just over here. So I'm hoping that should make a pretty good picture. So I'm just gonna sit this out, wait for that uh, sun to pop up, and uh, I'll catch you guys in a bit. Right, so waiting around uh, paid off. We've got some lovely light hitting those fells now. So I decided to go for a panoramic photo once again. Um, I decided to do a couple. So I've got one sweeping from Brothers Water just down here, sweeping over towards the right. And then I did a separate one from Place Vale, capturing Owls Water, sweeping around to the left, up to the Helvellum range just up there. So with filters on this, once again, we used a 0.9 soft edge graduated filter. Uh, camera settings, we was at ISO 100, a fifth of a second, and F10 for the aperture. Right, so that's about me done here for today. I'm now going to head back that way, back down to the tarn, uh, pack all my stuff away and then I'm gonna head back down to the car. So, as always, if you've liked this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you wish to see future videos, then please subscribe to my channel. And once again, thank you very much, guys, for watching.
So once again, if you've liked this video, if oh, you